Hello my friend, how are you doing? I'm Said and today I'm back with a new review but this one is especially about the meteorite. Mm, I have already recorded a video on this channel about mm, how we can professionally mm, distin um, detect a meteorite from ordinary rocks. But the some of you emailed me and tell me if you can upload a new video and show us a simple way, a simplest way, because those ways was so hard and we are not professional and we can have any advance um, for laboratory or something like that. Because I decided um, decision to uh, take decision to record this video this you are see and you are watching right now and um, I want to tell you a easier way other than the ones I described to identify a real rock the form the ordinary rock meteorite these rocks are very same to ordinary rock and detection of this rock is so hard even if you be a professional, a geologist or a meteorologist or something like that, you can't find out what's in your hand in first look. I want to show you the ways, the very very unique ways you can very easy identify a meteorite from ordinary rock. Meteorite fragment of rock or metal that fall to earth from space. They are very rare but many people find unusual rocks or pieces of metal and wonder if they might have found a meteorite. Meteorites have several um, properties that help um, distinguish um, them from other rocks. The first one is density. They are so heavy. They are so dense. And the first option, so uh, and first simple way for detecting a meteorite is you um, focus on density. Meteorites are usually quite heavy for their size, uh, since they contain metallic iron and dense minerals. And another thing, uh, which I told you before of this video on the, that first one, is the magnetic. Since most meteorites contain the metallic iron, a magnet will often stick of them. For a stony meteorite, a magnet might not stick, but if you hang a magnet by a string, it will be attracted, just for a little, but it will be attracted and move the magnet. Another way is um, unusual shape. You can f easily find out it's a meteorite or not if you search on Google and see the real meteorite pictures. The meteorite are um, they have the unusual shape. Iron nickel meteorites are rarely rounded. Um, instead, they have an um, irregular shape with unusual pits like fingerprint in their surface. We call them regmaglips. And that's an icon for meteorite. And you can from this option can easy found that your rock is a meteorite or not. Just like the finger on it is something soft. And, and another thing, it's so easy. It's um, it's a meteorite um, light colored crystal. Like quartz is a common uh, light colored crystal in Earth in Earth Earth's crust, but it's not found on other bodies in the solar system. All right, so so be careful. Your meteorite not be a crystal and a lightning. In so so special. Um, 
topic we had uh, some um, uh, crystallized uh, the meteorite but they are so so rare it's so rare one in uh, maybe million uh, maybe more or less all right another thing is uh, another this option is uh, no one maybe no one else maybe didn't told you but I will the bubbles the bubbles um, the volcanic rock or metallic slag on earth often have um, the bubbles um, or um, uh, whiskles in them you know what I'm talking about the bubbles the, the, that um, the circle shape on the stone is the full of the shape the meteorite it's not have the many shape on on itself right they must be just be rig, rigmaglyphs is something different and the, the and last one is a streak if you um, scratch a meteorite on a an on un, unglazed um, um, ceramic surface or something like that it should not leave a streak right because they are I told you they are so dense and you can't um, you can easy break them because they are so dense and so heavy and they 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 atom is so put together and you can't um, break them so easy and um, yeah if you scratch a, a meteorite by ceramic it's not uh, must be streak all right because they are so dense and um, the, the, these tips I told you in this video is the all you know, the tests you can do on your rock um, which you can be sure it's a meteorite or not meteorite or a wrong meteorite as you English say but uh, after all this uh, I want to say thank you from you all because I know my English is so terrible and horrible but I'm working on my language and I will be better a video after another one and thank you for watching um, I'm just an amateur um, meteorologist not an English grammar teacher and thank you for watching this video please if you this is your first time you watch this video from channel me me right or better I say me like me to write please subscribe to our channel we have another video except the meteorite we have a uh, vlog to found the crystal in the mountain I'm living in Iran and we have so beautiful place uh, around our town and I will promise you I will be show you all around my city if you subscribe to this channel. Alright, see you next time. Just be careful. Peace out.